Hi, I'm Victoria Roberts. I'm a mixed media artist. I've been uh, doing mixed media assemblage for the last 10 years. And um, one of the pieces I did was the flag, the American flag. I started doing them several years ago, and it's been a progression of ideas. And um, as I started doing more and more flags, they seemed to resonate with people. And so I, I started doing research on the flag. And so Mark got inspired to do an entire show on just my flags. Um, I'm very excited about that. I love, I've always loved the imagery of the American flag. And um, I started researching the flag and getting to know, I knew some of the history of the flag, but I, I started researching and doing, really understanding the flag more in all the different periods of the flag. So I tried to represent some of them in the, the different historic periods in the show, in the, some of the different pieces I made. And um, every single flag has just has a, a different inspiration, different idea attached to it. And um, I, I, it's one of the favorite things I've ever done. So This piece is called United States of America. As I see that the United States is has been getting seems to be more and more divided i wanted to make it uh make a flag that represents that that concern that i have for the separation of of uh people in this country because i'm really hopeful that we can unite at, uh, at, on all the things we love about the country so it's the united is faded intentionally so uh, and then some of the the um, stripes are kind of falling at the bottom so we need to like come back together so it can all be perfect again this piece is called and justice for all um, as I was doing uh, my research on flag on the United States flag I saw a flag in the book that I was reading that had the eagle in the center. It was one of the early designs of the flag that never did get used, obviously, but I really liked it. So I decided to make this flag with um, some, one of the early messages of our country and justice for all. So that's what this one represents. This piece, uh, this flag represents uh, it furthers my concept about uh, the distress in this country, of the divisions in this country. Um, the flag upside down and backwards flying on a ship is a distress signal. And so this is my distress signal uh, with the SOS, Save Our Souls. And um, I really feel that our country needs healing. So it's just my uh, cry for help. Uh, and part of the uh, collection. This piece is uh, called, this flag is called Parallel Universe. Um, I keep seeing on the news people talking about how if you, depending on what uh, news channel you watch, um, we live in parallel universes. So I thought that I would express that in one of the flags and it was a fun concept and it kind of looked cool. So um, that's what this piece is about, Parallel Universe. This flag is uh, kind of self, uh, self-describing. It's the State of the Union. The red is on one side, the blue is on the other. Um, this is the way um, I express that the division I see in the country. And um, basically, otherwise, it's just the American flag. This piece is called, Who Are We? And basically, it's just meant to make people think about that. Who are we? And who do we want to be? So that's it for this one. I remember reading somewhere years ago that the United States was the greatest human experiment. So I thought I would take the original uh, flag from 1776. This was one of the designs they used. and. Um, and make this greatest human experiment flag. This piece, the Star Spangled Banner, is um, was inspired by my research of history of uh, when Francis Scott Key wrote the Star Spangled Banner. 
Uh, he was at Fort McHenry. He was actually outside of Fort McHenry in a boat watching uh, as the bombs burst through air. And um, the flag was a 15 star and 15 stripe flag. So I did this this research when I was when I was doing all the flags, and I, I just I felt like I had to do a representation of that flag that was flying over Fort McHenry um, back in 1814. This flag is called our own worst enemy, and I just feel I can't help but feel that that is kind of how this country has become, as we're our own worst enemy. The the um, in the stars, the red uh, bottle caps are spell U.S. So that's U U.S. Our own worst enemy, and that's um, it, it can be interpreted in any way you like. But it just feels that that's uh, what we are <laughs> at this point. This flag is called "You Are Here." And basically, that's where you are in the United States. So I just thought I would do one flag like that. You are here. I wanted to do a smaller flag. And the only way to do that um, was to do the stripes horizontally, I mean, vertically instead of horizontally. Um, I saw uh, they had this, I had this palette in my studio that I'd been using for to dab the paint. And I just thought that is the perfect size. So I thought I'd do with my um, artistic license, do the, a flag with uh, the palette and the stripes going a different way, entitled it US Art.